I don't know what happened, okay? Like, oh yes I do. This, um, my laptop died. I didn't even know the battery was low. I don't know how that happened. <sighs> Did it say covered or not? So the time is now 6.38. My, um, second shipment of Amazon packages. I, that don't sound right. It's just aluminum foil and a top, like a sweat top, a top that I can sign a suit top type thing. But, um, matter of fact, duh. Oh, it ain't showing it right here. And guess what? The soap that I used, it went up again. I can't keep doing this. I spent $56 for the four bars last time. And I'm down to like a half of a bar. Oh, they just threw me off. Yeah, the bitch tried to lie on me. This is what the top looks like. And recall, I said I was, I needed some aluminum foil because I'm going to be driven up, grilling. I, I um, took the meat out to thaw about an hour or two ago. Um, I also have some beans soaking. You heard that. You saw me prepping them <laughs> while I was washing dishes. Um, oh, look, a little light. You can almost see me. So, um, <laughs> what? The. What made me start recording, you know, I didn't know which way they was going to go with it. I just put a few pictures on Facebook. Like, I'm going to tell you how many. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four. Twenty four pictures on Facebook, right? I put twenty four pictures on Facebook to kind of distract and curve the government, all right? I had been putting that in there. Where it's public right away. I'm, every day I'm active on Facebook, but not where it's public. Uh, that's not correct for this. So, um, they. I really shouldn't talk about it. Um, my assignment, I'm going to be, I feel like I need to eat again, like, what time was that? That was my improvement, I was waiting for that package, and it came finally, and I finally did the little stuff in the kitchen, and got around to eating, but I feel hungry again already. They said they're trying to get me to realize they want me to order food. I'm not ordering no food. <sighs> it all makes sense. I don't even have like a rug pub or um, account or what's the other one? Dash, DoorDash or Uber Eats. I don't have none of that stuff. And I need, I would need it for the type of um, food that I might want to eat, like something from a restaurant. Like I probably get TGIFs or Longhorn, and I'm not doing that. At every time it, it's gotten to the point on probably a handful of occasions where I've almost set up an account to get that food to me, but I always end up backing up.
That just don't believe in it. But what did I do? Why would you say that at the same time? So that's that. That's that. This. 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 Who wait? I don't know about this assignment. Like I got a part A and a part B. <laughs> I mean, I don't have a part. It's a two-part assignment. It's like two. It's a worksheet with 15 portions, and then, and if you slow, and you know you used to the um, curriculum going away. And I said it's a lot of slow kids in college. Like they don't look or are legally being called, you know, off or handicapped, but they are. Um, and you know them. You see it all the time. Like, but if you off. You, you wouldn't know because you get used to the same thing with these courses, you know, like um, pretty much they're five weeks long and if there's a roll up at the on the fifth week, it's going to pretty much cover the last five weeks or the last four, you know, or five, but this one. It's not about the five weeks we just did. You got to remember your predecessors. Like, I'm talking about, I'm, I'm, I had to name some stuff from the first course I took and the second course I took. Wasn't my second course statistics? Not the second, maybe the third. This, how many am I in? I've done three so far, this being the third. So I had to name some stuff, mostly from that first course. And it ain't normally like that. And the funny part is I had just said <coughs> that I would have liked to see, you know, something that kind of tied in too. But the way I imagined it, it's like the ebooks would have to be like a collector's edition, you know, where one or more authors collectively write a a series of ebooks for the entire you know what I'm saying thing the entire um, program like every course is going to be the same author saying you know different books and whereas now it's like different authors different books none of them tie in the um, stuff that was previously went over type thing. It, that's just it, extra. You don't need to know all that. That's who. Okay, so when I look at my PowerPoint, I'm just trying to gauge how much I got to mentally prepare myself for this. <laughs> See where I'm at. Because you know I'm going to smoke the rest of that, um, that other joint today. It's almost 7. Not even quite 15 minutes till. Stop touching me in my thigh. So, um. I have to mentally prepare myself to get these blocks of times right. So of my PowerPoint, it had to be 15 to 20 slides. I have 19 slides. And I'm just going to go through and see where I'm at. Because I need to add something more to most of them.
it's so crazy i spent so much time on it yesterday that it was impressive it looked good but i'm gonna put this under this video on facebook so you can see what i'm talking about but it looked impressive but it, it um i wasn't able to see it like back away from it so i could see what it needed and now looking at it freshly today it, it looks even better really kind of um but i'm able to quickly determine what's missing so i'm thinking i'm just going to need to add a lot of definitions that's it i tried to make this really basic i don't want to have to do a lot of citations and i already got a ton but that's because i use pictures i decided to add pictures at the last minute last night and that's making me rack up citations but this looks good Gambling disorder needs work. Sexual dysfunction needs work notes. And I think up until that point, no. earlier today they act like they stole my homework assignment like my worksheet because they were talking about how i came up with answers that no one else did and they knew they know that i believe that there's only a right answer so they knew i was going to search till i found it so i still need to give that quite a bit of time but I'll, that's why i'm seeing what this powerpoint needs so what i'm going to do is the assignment for this was to pretty much list his orders. Uh, I'm going to go with the definition approach rather than telling exactly what how they differ because if I were to tell how they would differ, I would have to minimize or reduce the number of disorders that I listed. And this is actually a learning tool for me. Like, when I do something like an assignment like this, especially like PowerPoints and stuff, I try to put pack so much information into it that it would be a good reference for me. So if I want to know something about it, I can go to it. Rather than going to the book or the internet i'll be like let me go see what i wrote about this before and so. y'all are the devil Television you smoked <laughs> right before you got in the shower and and some people are not able to tell that I smoked it all well and look I it's weird because before I picked this up and got started to I was talk, going off kind of on them about having smoked and not feeling any bit of it and um <laughs> now that I'm doing this and listening to my speech while I talk I can see the difference <laughs> because whereas I would refrain from like rendering so many details you probably think I'm just detail oriented to begin with but I'll go break it down to the smallest <laughs> motherfucking like I have to stop myself And I do think I talk like that because that's how I learn. So, you know, 
when you read, especially these motherfucking books, when you read these books, the jargon, like the lingo, the way that it's written, I'm like, man, it's got to be another way to say that. And that, that, that's what ends up happening. I have to put it into my own words. And... But I'm like, why couldn't you just have said this? It's written that way because they don't want everyone to get it. You get what I'm saying? Like, literature is a part also of mind control tactics. You get what I'm saying? So, like, just the way you word things, it, it there's always intention. And for things that you don't want all to know or all to be available to all, you, you easily hide it in literature. All you got to do is say a bunch of motherfucking words or say a few motherfucking words that are too big. Like, I talked about this before about how three things meant the same thing, but it was a matter of, it looks like demographics really like social tiers. So, if you're in the lower tier, the middle tier, or upper class, you know, um, elite kind of like, which one of those groups depends on which word you use and you often see people in this middle thing using words from here and even once in a while from here you see them using words from here it's the demons and how they decide to use the identities but you don't never see nobody from here using this shit you don't never see nobody from here using this shit ever Okay, so three um, bullet points describe the disorders and explain their differences. I think that that can be achieved with a definition. Shouldn't be looked at much different. Especially since I'm covering so many disorders. What I did was I went through literally every chapter and I put out whatever um, disorder or um, mental illness was discussed. And I did that for me. You get what I'm saying? Like I said, this is supposed to be a tool later for me. Um, and then it says, discuss how these disorders are influenced by the legal system. I did that already. Discuss how the legal system is influenced by these disorders. I've done it already. So after I put in these definitions and finish the citations with this PowerPoint, I'll be done with it. Now this worksheet is a whole nother story. I'm going to have to work on this some tomorrow too. Yeah, because, yeah, 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 yeah. They know I'll be trying to get my, um, she was a day early, trying to get my assignments in early so that I can, um, get me another day off. <laughs> and, um, hopefully get the grade back quicker but there was no chance at that this week that's only happened once ever or I caught a professor or a doctor on during um, the day that they were grading and I happened to submit my assignment that was due for that next week or for coming up due and ended up getting it graded at the same time so I got two grades at once. And that was never the objective for this this week. I didn't want to do this at all this week. And you know I faced going to jail this week. So it was just all bad for me. Like which is why I had to spend so much time on it yesterday. And which is why I was end up spending a lot of time on it today. All of like eight hours breaking in between I had a drink I had some Crown Royal some Rebel Risky and Coke oh my goodness my Coke is gonna go bad my can has been open and it ain't the um, name brand stuff it's the Sam's Club stuff it'll go flat as fuck the police just flew up the street with their sirens on this has been like I don't know 
not even 10 minutes ago, but maybe almost that. Um, I'm about to eat something. I'm taking a break from this assignment. Um, if I recall correctly, was the last time I checked, my package was out for delivery. But they're coming from Cleveland, so it's not too much. They are right around the fucking corner from me. They're on Cole Avenue. Deliverer has to make a few deliveries. You said I was the next one, but it says now the deliverer has to make a few um, more deliveries on the way to my address. But it's literally within about six, seven blocks. I'm waiting on my food to warm up, but they did the same thing that they did with the other Amazon order. When I, um, watched it on its way in when i looked i thought that it was like literally just a couple of blocks away so i'm like okay so it's probably coming to me even though it doesn't say i'm next and i turned my front camera on that they're claiming is not my camera and here comes the amazon driver pulling up in a white minivan similar to the one that the female next door has um i wasn't able to get him like um uh, you know, like last time they malfunctioned it. Like I recorded the entire time and you never saw the driver get out and um, walk up the driveway. This time was different. I deviated in the middle of the recording, but I still should have caught him at least opening the door because I waited that long. But I deviated because he sent me a text that says, you know, like he was arriving with the Amazon order and if I had any pets, the police secure him. And so I had to log into my Amazon account in order to check that message that he sent. I thought he had a question about which unit it was, but that wasn't it. So he, um, my door, my porch camera caught him. When he, um, and if you're really thinking about it and you're really reading in between the lines and you know what happened prior, you would realize that Amazon, Amazon is posing as Walmart today. Because when Walmart sends a deliver out, they don't have a fleet of trucks that say Walmart on them. It sends out like a regular vehicle. And most of the time, that's a minivan or an SUV, like a mini SUV. Um, so that's what happened both times today. Amazon didn't put the truck on the street because recently they put the truck on the, put the truck on the street for the apartment downstairs to claim that they were me. Okay? So that was them trying to make sure that, like, Amazon didn't show up for me, like, you get what I'm saying? Like, not in the vehicle that's identified with them. I'm still working on my assignment. The time is now 9.24. I planned on eating again before 9, but I guess I won't get to it. If I get hungry, I'll have some yogurt. If I get hungry, I'll have some yogurt. Oh, I did make me a shopping cart on Victoria's Secret. I got this um, card the last time I went. And it's only through the 8th, like the 8th through the 21st of September. So, you know, I ain't leaving a, my place for two weeks. So, I was like, you know, maybe it applies to purchases online too. And it did. Um, but it ends up being like, I just, I'm not sure that it's worth it. I'm just not sure if it was worth it. And you know I'm going to jail. But though none of that matter. It doesn't matter. And I I need more new panties. Like I, I've been purging them like just for the last month and a half. Like trying to get rid of the old Walmart brand panties. Like even though they're all thongs. Get rid of them. Like and get panties that I would normally wear. Like um, because there is a difference in the material. <laughs> okay i'm still working on my assignment i'm completely i think i'm gonna set that the last time i checked in but i'm completely done with my worksheet so that's good i should get a, a a on it um i might have missed one but like i said i should get an a um on this um powerpoint i'm working on it now i'm only on the sixth slide but two of those six prior need more work um I'm, I'm working in a way that i normally work i bounce around but it's effective 
this is how I make myself do something when I don't want to do it. Right now, I really don't feel like doing this, and I'm not very, um, I don't want to have to focus, I, I don't want to have to be very attentive on what I'm doing, so what I'm, I'm, I'm just bouncing around and um, changing anything that stands out to me, but still with some type of order, so that means as I go through each slide, I'm trying to make sure that I at least make sure they all have their definition, and the speaking notes is where I really don't want to I don't want to have to <laughs> give that much attention so I'm just <clears throat> you're choking me 